Hello, you are welcome to solve this math problem, which is 2 over x times 2 over x is equal to x over 2. To find the values of x from this equation. Now, in the first step, we'll take this 2 times 2, it is 4, over x times x, it is x square, is equal to x over 2. Then, from here, we'll cross multiply. So, it will be 4 times 2, it is 8, is equal to x square times x, it is x power 3. Then, we'll take this x power 3 to the left side, so it will be 8. Then, this will take this side to be minus x power 3 is equal to 0. Then, from this 8, 8 is same as 2 power 3 minus x power 3 is equal to 0. Then, from here, this is in the form of a perfect cube. So, we'll apply a perfect cube rule in this form, whereas this is in the form of a power 3 minus b power 3 is equal to a minus b bracket bracket a square plus a b plus b square bracket. So when you compare a power 3 with 2 power 3, then a is equal to 2. And when you compare b power 3 with x power 3, then b is equal to x. Then we'll apply this form here. So, a minus b, it will be 2 minus x. So, here 2 minus x, then bracket, bracket, a square, it will be 2 square, which is 4. Then plus a times b, it will be 2 times x, it is 2x. Plus b square, b square, it will be x square. Then bracket is equal to this 0. Then in the next step, from here, we have two solutions, whereas this is first solution, which is 2 minus x is equal to 0, and this second solution, which is 4 plus 2x plus x square is equal to 0. Then from here, we'll take negative x to this side, so it will be x, when we take x to this side, it will be x is equal to this 2. So this is the first value of x which is real solution and so from this quadratic equation let's rearrange it so we start with this x square then plus this 2x then plus this 4 is equal to 0 then from this quadratic equation to solve here to find the value of x we'll use quadratic formula so from quadratic formula which is x is equal to negative b plus or minus square root of b square minus 4ac over 2a. So it will be x is equal to negative b, b it is this 2, so it will be negative 2 plus or minus square root of b square. It will be 2 square which is 4 then minus 4 times a, a it is 1 times c, c is 4 then over 2 times a, a it is 1. Then in the next step, it will be x is equal to negative 2 plus or minus square root of 4 minus 4 times 4, it is 16. Then over this time, this is 2. So it will be x is equal to negative 2 plus or minus square root of 4 minus 16 is minus 12 then over 2 so from here or right here then it will be x is equal to negative 2 plus or minus square root of negative 12 is same as square root of 4 times 3 times negative 1 then over 2 then in the next step, it will be x is equal to negative 2 plus or minus square root of 4. Square root of 4, it is 2, times this square root of 3. Square root of negative 1, it is i. Then we divide by 2 in this part and in this part. 
So it will be x is equal to negative 2 divided by 2, it is negative 1. Then plus or minus this 2 and this 2 will cancel. So it will be plus or minus i square root of this 3. So also from here we have two complex solutions. Therefore, the first value of x is equal to this 2 here, the first solution, which is real solution. The second solution is equal to here, complex solution, which is negative 1 plus i square root of 3. So negative 1 plus i square root of 3. The third value of x is equal to negative 1 minus i square root of 3. So these are all the values of x in this our problem. Thank you for watching. Don't forget these steps to miss out. Subscribe to my channel and see you in the next video. Bye bye.